I have a question I wanted to ask if uh, I am the executor over a state and uh, over the property, of course, and uh, you would like to sell it. Um, do you have to involve the rest of the heirs if you decide that you want to sell it? All right. Good question. Well, the short answer on that one actually is yes, by saying you're the executor, the executrix is usually the, the female version of that, it means that there is a law, I'm sorry, there is a will that has been probated, and the power that is given to you under the will does not give you the exclusive right to sell the property. Under Alabama law, the second that the person passed away, the property passed to the heirs and when you probated the will that obviously showed us who those heirs are so the heirs actually have an ownership interest in that land and um, most title companies now and, and most lawyers are going to require all of the heirs to sign that deed and uh, have their signatures notarized so that they can't come back years later and, and assert a claim that's the short answer but can they dictate the the asking price or that sort of thing that would be a decision made in the probate court. Okay. The, the heirs could absolutely disagree. Okay. Um, uh, if there were three of us and we were all heirs and we mm -hmm. sold a parcel, and I said, well, I don't want it to be sold, I could buy both of your portions out sure. and, of course, bid in mine as a credit. So, yes, you do have some say mm -hmm. because you're the heir. You, you now own that parcel mm -hmm. subject to any claims that may arise from the probating of the will or the last uh, affairs of the estate that need to be paid off. And, and an easy way to view that is the will dictates to the executrix what she is supposed to do, not the other way around. Exactly right, exactly right.